Hi, in this video I will show you how you can create a digital garden like this with your obsidian vault. If you are using obsidian and want to share your notes online then this video will help you. Obsidian Publish is a great tool but uh, it comes with a heavy fees like $20 a month and if you don't want to pay that much amount to obsidian publish this non-technical guide will help you to set up your own digital garden for free this is my digital garden that i have created recently where i share all of my notes online and it's pretty good just like the obsidian publish it has wiki links it also has graph view at the bottom of every note so you can see all the links between your notes just like you do on your obsidian vault and you don't need a custom domain to use this or publish your publish your notes online you can also choose what notes you want to share or uh, what you don't want to share i will show that at the end of this video on how you can do that so now let's begin uh, the tutorial for that you will you will first need a github template that i will provide link in the description then you need a github account I, a github desktop app netlify and syncToy if you don't have a github account then you just need to create it by going to github.com once you have created a, your github account then you need to click on the link in the description uh, which is a link to this digital garden Jack, jackal template by maxim once you are on this web page click on use this template name something uh, like your digital garden choose public and click on create repository from template this template is now copied to our github account now you need to download the github desktop app just search for github desktop app on google and you will be provided with the download link from here download github for windows we are using it on windows so we'll be using this download once you have downloaded launch this application github desktop now you need to clone the online repository on your local machine for that you will just need to click on add over here and click on clone rep repository you can also do that by going over here file clicking on file and click on clone repository and this is the one that we created right now digital garden and click on clone this github repository is now cloned to our local machine and it will be in this folder documents github and inside this there is the digital garden this is our uh, github repository now you need to launch a static site using netlify it's a free now you need to launch a static site using Netlify. We'll just click on login or let's just sign up over here. I already have signed up with another account so it will just show it here. And if you are new, you just click on add a new site. Click on import existing project and you need to connect your GitHub account. Right now I am not seeing the repository that I want here so I'll just click on configure the Netlify app. I'll just confirm my password here and I'll click on all repositories and just click on save. Now here's the repository that we have just recently created. We'll just click on Digital Garden. And don't change anything over here. Click on Deploy Site. And the site deploy is in progress and it will take somewhere between 3 to 5 minutes to deploy your site. The site is deployed now. Let's just check how it is. This is your digital garden. And if you click on your first node, you will see 
it also has a graph at the bottom and also wiki links and backlinks let's go to netlify again and click on site setting and change the site name over here click on change site and write something like digital garden click on save and it, your site name will look something like this digital garden 12.netify.app but if you want to use a custom domain then you can also do that just go to site overview click on domain setting and add a custom domain from here and you need to, you also need to uh, change the c name on your domain service provider so we'll not go to that right now now what we need to do is add the nodes that we have on our obsidian to our digital garden for that we'll first need to go to our local machine and let's uh, for example uh, for this example we'll just copy our previous obsidian nodes onto the uh, repository folder i'll click on my obsidian board and choose some of these folders references and for my nodes and i'll just copy all of these and go to my documents folder github and this one digital garden and paste all of these nodes in this folder underscore nodes all of your nodes will be here these are the nodes that are previously here i'll just click on paste now all of these nodes are in this folder underscore nodes let's just push them to the online repository go to your github app and it will see changes in all the files that have recently occurred we'll need to uh, write something in the summary let's just write a simple letter click on commit to master and all the changes will be pushed to the github online repository click on push origin over here now if you go back to your netlify account you will see that the site is being deployed again because there are new recent changes on the online repository here you can see it's building again because there are new files and those will be added in this site The site is live now let's go and see what it looks like right now let's go to digital garden 12.netify.app and you might see there are no changes in this first home page because we have not changed our home page let's just go to your first node and if you go down you will see that all of our nodes are added over here in the graph view since this uh, site doesn't have a navigation you will need to add something like i have done on my digital garden to give a little clue to the visitors that you have like this to so that they can start exploring your digital garden if you want to change your home page like this that i have made you can go to your online local machine repository and you have to edit the index file inside your local repository file go on go into pages and you will find this index.md file which you can edit this is our home page and you can edit it i'm using sublime texture you can also use obsidian to edit this and after you have changed your home page you can launch the github desktop app and again push these changes and netlify app will start building the site again and that's how you set up your digital garden online for free